Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Tonight I'm going out with the girls and I'm not 100% sure what kind of look I'm going for so let's just do it together and see where it takes us. So I got the primer on and I'm going to apply my favorite foundation by Fenty Beauty Pro Filter in the shade 230. I like to use my thick angled foundation brush to really buff the product into the skin. Then I'm going back again with the same brush and some of the mocha match sticks from Fenty to warm up the complexion. Before applying the concealer, I like to use some of the brightening corrective first. I really like how it makes the area brighter and it works very well with the concealer. For my eyebrows, I'm using this chocolate color and whoa, that turned out a bit dark than what I usually wear. But that's okay, it just means that I will have to keep the accent on the eyes tonight. I primed my eyelids and then I'm going with a eye pencil to create a soft winged eyeliner. I'm using the eye pencil first before applying the eyeshadow just because I want it to be there more as a base than the actual eyeliner. Then I'm going to take some of that very light shade of brown with a fluffy brush and apply it on the crease of my eyes and underneath the eyes. It's going to help to define the shape and set the tone for my whole look. Then I'm going back with a more deeper color to intensify the look. Move your fluffy brush in a very light motion to make sure you blend it all well. I'm using my finger to apply gold pigment all over my eyelids and then I'm going back to pick up some lighter pigment to apply in the center of my eyelids to create dimension. So I'm going to blend out the edges a bit more and go back with my eye pencil, connect it all together, blend them and then use a little bit of concealer to clean up the light. Then I'm going to highlight the brow bone and my tear duct. I finished my eye look and I'm going to set my makeup with a translucent setting powder. I like to use a small sponge and apply it on the areas where the makeup tends to move more. For my blush, first I'm going to apply this peachy color and then use another shimmery pinky color on top. Because my eye look turned out to be quite full on, I want to keep my lips looking as soft as possible. I'm actually quite happy how this whole look turned out. Um, I think it matches my dress, which is perfect. And let me know, would you rock this look on a girl's night? Leave me a comment and don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye.